Once again, ladies and gentlemen, three rounds this scheduled in the featherweight division. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the blue corner, a jiu-jitsu practitioner standing 5 feet 10 inches tall. He weighed in officially 147 and one-third pounds and brings a professional record of nine victories, two defeats, and one no contest in the cage tonight. From South Shields, England, here is Alex Enlund! And next is opponent across the cage, finding out of the red corner, a mixed martial artist standing five feet, nine inches tall. He weighed in 145 and three quarter pounds and brings a veteran record of eight victories and seven defeats. From Dublin, Ireland, here is the prospect killer, Artem Lobon! <laughs> Referee in charge once again is Rich Mitchell. Referee Rich Mitchell about to get this featherweight contest underway. Alex Enland in the Ready. white and blue trunks. Let's go. Artem Lobov in the dark blue is the prospect killer. Going to kill <laughs> another prospect here, Josh. No touch of gloves. Immediately out with the uppercut is Lobov. He's been trying to taunt Alex Enland into standing and trading with him. Enlund told us yesterday that he didn't really have intentions on doing that. No, he's he going to stick to what he knows. He knows exactly what he needs to do and looking for an early takedown, switching off to the Uchimata. Good defense by Lobov though. Enlund is extremely powerful at featherweight. Has a tremendous strength and conditioning regime. He certainly won't be afraid to maybe pull guard even here against Lobov if that's what it takes to get the fight to the ground. Uh, been an interesting decision if that's what happens, but at the moment, well, there you go. I wonder if Artem will slam him from here. <laughs> I think Artem's the kind of guy who'll try anything once. Maybe twice if it doesn't hurt too much. Yeah, it's interesting to see he hasn't tried to create too much space here at the moment. Now, one thing we know about Artem is that he's got no problem going the distance if required. Yeah, Real grueling fight against Jay Furness. This is it, he doesn't get stopped very often. Um, he, he does tend to find his way to decisions. He has, however, had a couple of interesting submission losses on uh, Cage Warriors before. Submission's obviously the specialty of Alex Enlund. Robin looking very confident here. Yeah, he's got a good, by the hips. good frame in there. And driving for the takedown. He's in on the single now, looking to move to the body lock. And Artem finds his way back to the cage. Great balance there from Artem Lobov. Yeah, it really was. And they had the takedown from Alex Enlund. We oh, knew it was going to come. Yeah, look for him to climb straight to the back. And this is not where Lobov wants to be. Very few people in the featherweight division want Alex Enlund on the back. That's it. His, uh, his finishing rate when he gets these dominant positions is absolutely tremendous. He doesn't give up. He's and going he's to be under careful here, he's given up the rear naked choke. Oh, Artem Lobov has tight. a habit of going to sleep in these submissions. That's really tight, Josh. This one could be over soon. We've Artem doing his best to fight this one off. Yeah, we've seen Artem go to sleep a couple of times. This one could be all over. It looks like Lobov's out, and this one is over. Artem Lobov choked unconscious in the first round by Alex Enlund. It was going to end one way or the other, Josh. Alex, uh, Alex Enlund with an incredible submission there. We've said that Alex Enlund, when he gets on a guy's back, it is route one jiu-jitsu to the finish. And as soon as he got hold of Artem Lobov, he went straight for the neck, and it was just in for the kill. Alex Enlund just showing us his Art Suave tattoo. Jiu-jitsu really the way of life and getting the job done there. Fantastic performance from Alex Enlund, a very disappointed Artem Lobov. We're going to take a look at some replays of that action now. And Lobov really swung from the hip there, but in doing so, gave Alex Enlund the opportunity to come in and get that single leg. Yeah, and you can see what happens. Once he got the chance, he hopped straight to the back, both hooks in. Taking the back now as he sets up the submission victory. There's the choke, there's the squeeze. And Artem Lobov goes out. We'll throw this one to Joe Martinez in the cage to make it official.
Ladies and gentlemen, the end comes officially. Two minutes, 24 seconds. Round number one. Technical submission for your winner from South Shields, England, Alex Inland.